You know, living in the mountains of North Carolina, my wife and I bought this farm. It wasn't really a farm, it was just raw land, but we bought this property about 15 years ago. And living here has given me the opportunity to live in very close touch with nature. One of the things that I've so enjoyed about learning about bees and about their habits is the, the natural wonder of it all. The bees are incredibly gentle creatures. Um, I spent the first part of my adulthood as a designer craftsman building furniture and cabinets and working uh, in the shop a lot. And uh, I found that, that that history, now that I'm closer to retirement age, that history has given me a great foundation for uh, my love of craftsmanship as well as uh, my capabilities to design. I've spent three years now working on this design project, gone through four prototypes, several different roofs, several different chambers, several different approaches to the frames. I'm very pleased now and we're ready to go to the next level. We believe this hive will appeal to beekeepers, both beginners and advanced beekeepers worldwide. And we would like your help in launching this product and perfecting it in the manufacturing process. This hive differs from other hives in, in several significant ways. Obviously the shape is different. It's a hexagonal cylinder. And what that means is that the bees have, have smaller, slightly smaller chambers, but more importantly, they're better insulated and they're better isolated from the elements. So the bees have an easier time maintaining their temperature in the hive, be it cooling or heating. Another difference in this hive system is that it has a central entrance. Most beehives have either top or bottom entrances, and what that means is the bees are trampling through comb and chambers to get to where they want to go. In our hive, the central entrance creates a hallway with a dance floor and an IPM tray that pulls out so we can monitor mites or pests in the hive very easily without opening up the hive. There's also observation windows available which allows you to have a window on their world and peek inside to see how they're doing with the comb or the honey and how things are progressing with the cap brood. All of this means that we don't have to be quite so invasive on a frequent basis and, and history tells us the, the bees really can pretty well handle themselves but for the part where we have to intervene to help protect them from pests. These hives also differ in the sense that they fold open for easy access. This means that the beekeeper is lifting about half of the weight because of the hinging capability. It also means because of the one singular frame design that all hives have exchangeable frames from one box to another. This simplifies the process for the beekeeper and keeps the bees happy because they're used to the same size frame all the time. What's the plan? I'm glad you asked. The plan is to perfect the design so that it can be manufactured with precision in a CNC environment, a, a computer numerated controlled environment, where we can get absolute replicability, uh, rep, uh, we can replicate uh, all the joinery and all of the nuances of, of the hive construction with perfection. It also means we can deliver hives to you the way you're used to getting them, and that is in kit form where you get to control the assembly yourself and enjoy it, frankly enjoy part of it. Uh, after that, the plan is to very carefully choose our licensing partners throughout the world so that we have uh, the same quality standards in America that we have in Australia or Italy or Germany or Russia or pick your, pick your country. Our, our major game plan 
is to make these beehives more accessible to beekeepers of all types worldwide.